with a uh, gas finder infrared camera. I have a sample video that we've taken. I'm not even, I don't even know if your state uh, regulatory agency has these, but we have access to one thanks to a, a, a very dedicated person here in Pennsylvania who has uh, who's joined our organization, Frank Finnan, who's hiding out here with the camera, uh, is, is part of shale testing. Portable gas chromatograph is owned by Nidell, Chris Nidell's law firm, and we have access to that. We can use that as a screening mechanism and do a lot of broad water testing. Uh, stainless steel sand canister, we brought one of those for you to look at. This is the most accurate method to test air quality. And uh, so we'll be using those, and we've actually been taking some sumo canister samples uh, down in Pennsylvania uh, both last night and today. Um, and we have deals with nationally certified laboratories to give us uh, a little bit of a discount for uh, both air and water testing. And soil for that matter, that's one of the things that we do have capability to do. Um, air, soil, water, both ground, which is your, your well water and surface, which is your uh, streams and lakes. Now I'm going to try to make this work. Uh, let's see. This is a uh, infrared video that we've taken. Um, Frank was the uh, Frank was the uh, photographer in this, and unfortunately, this is not too far from Tim's house. It's in the well on his property, but it's not too far away. And if you can see, the emissions are coming out of this. Here's the two hatches, and here's the vent stack. And those emissions you can't see with your naked eye. And these are volatile organics. I mean, that's what. The, the gas finder is designed to find is volatile organics. So that'll also let us know where we need to take our canister samples from. Uh, 